we're walking into 4029 Northeast 73rd Avenue. My friend and colleague, Tara Stone from Brantley Christensen. This is her listing. Um, probably not gonna be on the market for much longer. And it is a three bedroom, two bath bungalow, three stories in the Roseway neighborhood. Roseway, if you don't know, the majority of houses here are built between the 20s and the 50s. So if those are areas that you're interested in, this happens to be a really well done, updated 1920s home. So follow me inside. The first thing you walk into is the great room. There is the living room and an extra little space over here for a sitting area. Two bathrooms, one on this floor, full bath here, a, ma a, a master bedroom on the main floor, fantastic fireplace. Again, it's three stories. So we have a master over here, the good size master. It's got a couple um, windows in there for lots of light, some built-ins. built-in cabinets as a lot of the older homes had. Love that they kept that in here. Great little architectural design within the framing of the windows. Nice new carpet in this room. And then we'll take a gander at the kitchen and the dining room. As you enter in through the door, to your right is the kitchen. Got some great quartz countertops here. Really nice. Lots of storage for all of your cooking goodies. Octagonal, sweet flooring in here. This tile is fantastic. Colors are amazing. Super sweet little bungalow here in Roseway. Come on this way and you can have a look at these beautiful original windows. Just fantastic. Off the dining room to our right is the stairs to the basement. We'll check that out in a little bit. Also, you kind of get a mudroom, a little bit of a feel in here because the backyard, there's a door from the back yard into here so you don't have to trek through the living room and dining room area, or sorry, the living room area. A nice little backyard back here. And some additional square footage that's totally usable in the basement where the washer and dryer are gonna get to. Um, and then we're gonna head upstairs to the other two bedrooms that are up there and back. One of the things that I love about Port Portland itself is all of the different architecture that you get. There's so much diversity when it comes to the homes that are here. and love every era. Everything is totally different. It's so charming. I love the older, older homes. I've had two myself. Come on upstairs. We have the smaller of the three bedrooms here for a nice office or whatever you want to make it out of. <laughs> Two really big bright windows in there as well. You gotta check out the tile in this bathroom though. A little nook over here. You might be able to put a desk and things in that area as well. Beautiful. That tile is incredible. And another large bedroom. Gorgeous. You can see the backyard from there as well. So even though you're living in the city, the backyard is a bit of an oasis. You get to have some privacy back there and a little garden space. This house is listed at $509,900. Heading down to the basement. Don't worry, it's not scary. It's not finished, but it's pretty sweet. Furnace is in here, water heater is in here. There's a little bit of extra space. Washer and dryer are gonna go down here and it looks like it would be a great area to do a variety of things when it comes to 
needing extra space and not wanting to get the house dirty. Again, by Tara Stone from Brantley Christensen Real Estate, which I am a part of as well. Thanks for showing up.